most relevant. I got a lot, but let me just see. Bona, okay, this one. I love this one. You ready? A lot of this stuff you've seen in the Islamicized series. Volume 4 of Sal Bukhari, number 779. Volume 4 of Sal Bukhari, number 779. Narrated Abdullah. We used to consider miracles as Allah's blessing, but you people consider them to be a warning. Once we're now, pay you got to pay attention to this one. This one, you got to pay attention. Once we were with Allah's apostle on a journey and we ran short of water, he said, Bring the water remaining with you. The people brought a utensil cont <laughs> containing a little water. <clears throat> he placed his hand in it and he said, Come to the blessed water and the blessings from Allah. I saw the water flowing among from among the fingers of Allah's apostle. And no doubt, before I, I'm going to stop right there. Notice, he put his fingers in the water, because I'm going to flick. Now notice what you just read. He put his fingers in, in, in the water, his hand. Receive the blessing. In other words, Muhammad's fingers were a miraculous water sprinkler. Who would have thunk it? Muhammad's fingers turned into a miraculous water sprinkler. Come to the blessing. Here, let me water your grass while we're at it. Oh, I, I forgot. We're in the desert. No grass. Forgive me. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. Okay. Here, let me quote that so you don't think I'm lying. Here you go. Okay, watch here. But the, the last part gets better. Okay, the last part gets, gets better. Watch here. He placed his hand in it. Here it goes. So you know I'm making up. And said, come to the blessed water. And the blessing, right? And the blessing is from Allah. I saw the water flowing from among the fingers of Allah's apostles. Who would have thunk Muhammad's fingers are water sprinklers? Wow. I'm blown away. Who's ready now to take Shahada? Who's ready now to take Shahada? Oh, but now you want let me read the rest of the hadith. Okay. I saw the water flowing from among the fingers of Allah's apostle, and no doubt, guys, get ready to pass out from laughter. And no doubt, here's the rest of it, guys. No doubt, we heard the meal, the food, glorifying Allah when it was being eaten by him. You didn't catch it. No doubt, we heard the food, the meal, glorifying Allah when Muhammad was about to eat it. Whoa! Whoa! Guys! Muhammad's food would speak to him. Muhammad's food would be praising Allah right at the moment Muhammad is about to eat. In other words, when Muhammad would pick up food, the food would say, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. I'm going to be eaten, digested by Allah's messenger. Oh Allah, how fortunate that I'm going to be in the mouth of your messenger. I'm going to be chewed by the teeth of your messenger. And I'm going to go down the digestive tract of your messenger and come out either as urine or poo poo of your blessed messenger. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Thank you, Allah. Ha, 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 ha. Ha, ha, ha. I'm not like, hey, it's in the article here. Guys, save the article. Okay. Okay, now, <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. Do you see why now I wore my Batman shirt? You see why I wore my Batman shirt? Man, this is straight out of a comic book, right? Even Batman is more realistic than Muhammad's hadiths, right? <laughs>